Good morning and welcome to the CMC Markets Chart of the Week video with me, Dev Madden. Today's date is Wednesday the 24th of April 2019 and the time is just gone 9.55 British Summer Time. This week's Chart of the Week is the Australian Dollar versus the US Dollar. And if you take a look at the Aussie Dollar Chart here, uh, the wider view, uh, we can see that from January 2018 all the way through now it's been in a fair, very obvious downward trend. Uh, one of the more noticeable things about this about this market in, in recent months has been that the 200-day moving average, this red line here, has acted as a fairly decent uh, barrier to any moves to the upside. It's been a fairly um, reliable um, re resistance point uh, in recent months. But if you look further back, we can see that it actually was acting as support uh, back in February 2018 on a few occasions. The rally in the highs of April 2018 Right up towards it didn't get quite close to it we can see that at the high in um, in early December 2018 got up towards it not quite there and then there's quite a good, good examples here in both January and also only actually er, uh, earlier this month where the market actually ran into the 200 moving average and actually failed to actually close above it so while we remain below the 200 moving average which currently comes currently comes into place in around 0 spot 7187 while we were in below that it's likely we could see further losses for the Australian dollar and if you do manage to press on lower from here we could be looking at targeting at uh, the most um, the, the, uh, the, the, the big psychological number of 0 spot 7000 and if you do manage to have a break below that it could take us back down towards 0 spot 6900 and a move below that might take us back to this region here in a zero spot 6840 uh, just, uh, we, we can see that that level hasn't been hit um, we haven't been down there since about January 2016 um, if we do manage to actually press on higher from here um, and actually manage to take out the recent high in around the zero spot 72 area and actually close above the 30 moving average we could then be actually uh, we could then begin to think that maybe the wider downward trend has come to an end and should be close above the 200 moving average on a daily basis it should be going to break north of zero spot seven two zero zero that could put us on, on track towards this area up here in around the zero spot seven three zero zero region and then a move beyond that could be could be looking up toward this area here just shy of zero spot seven four zero zero which which would be the uh, early December 2018 high uh, if you are going to be trading the Australian dollar versus the US dollar, uh, just just keep in mind um, the most recent inflation figures out of Australia overnight. The first the first quarter of 2019 uh, CPI headline inflation fell to 1.3 percent. It's this lowest rating uh, since late 2016. There has been a bit of increased chatter about the prospect of the Reserve Bank of Australia uh, cutting rates. Now, not all um, investment banks or, uh, or, or FX analysts believe that. But the, at least the fact, the very fact that some um, banks are calling for the for, for the RBA to cut rates could suggest uh, gives you an indication of what some participants in the market are are, are, uh, are thinking. It's also worth noting at the back end of this week on Friday uh, we have we have US, U.S. quarterly GDP and that, that's likely to add some volatility into the mix too. Uh, one last thing before I go. If you have any comments to make on this video or any of the other videos we've made here at CMC Markets, please feel free to leave a review and review. Thank you very much.